Of course, as a lawyer, I was happy for Mugarabai. Mugarabai being made a three-star general. Uh, I heard some lawyers saying, what will that bring to lawyer land? Yeah, that is how lawyers are. <laughs> that is how we are. You see, if a lawyer dies, a very junior person, you see, this is the second highest military person. But lawyer, some lawyers are saying, Kwanita Saidia ni a lawyer. But when Musando, an assistant director in the IEBC dies, it brings tension to the whole tribe. That is Luya for you. Uh, Luya, when a Luya gets something, instead of Luya celebrating, you'll find Luya castigating. After all, you bibiake na watoto wake. That is what comes from Luya. And Luya, anything bad befalling a Luya, the first person to celebrate will be a, a fellow Luya. Uh, that being that, this one, uh, today I wanted to comment about uh, the effect of Mugaravai's promotion on the Tawe movement. I have heard many, uh, many lawyers, actually those who are saying so, are very few, but most lawyers are happy. Uh, but... Uh, I wanted to only to talk about the effect, the political effect of that, especially on the Tawe movement. Uh, the non azimio Luhias have used that opportunity to thank President Ruto for the selection. But if you look at that selection carefully, Ruto did a very good balancing act. Remember, he never planned it, but it, Moi, people, people say me uruka uku una uku, but you see some things you just have to ruka ruka. Moi used to call himself, I used to say that uh, Anyang Nyong is a professor of politics. And Moi used to say that he was the professor in politics. No, Moi was never, was not, not even a UT in politics. He used to use torture. But uh, the real professor of politics in Kenya is Ruto. Look at Ruto. Suddenly, the chief general has died. Ruto was waiting for Mutai to take over. That is what he had planned. He wanted uh, Aluo to be there. So that uh, when it... The, look at uh, Paul Kelemba. Paul Kelemba, he, he has... Uh, if, you, if, you, if, you, if you tweet him, He'll send you that uh, chessboard he had shown, where Ruto had organized so well that the next person was to be Mutai. Luos are taken care of, so Kalenjin coming, come in. And he has placed himself so well that if today elections are held between um, uh, Kalonzo Musioka and Ruto, in Luo Nyanza, in Luo Nyanza, you'll find that 60% uh, of the voters, or even 75%, will vote for, Lu, for Ruto right now. Maybe it will reduce from 70 to 65 because of the unfortunate death. But Ruto being the real genuine political professor, used to that unfortunate and unforeseen uh, instance to now play ball well. How did he play the ball well? Look at the selection. I was looking at the newspaper. Chief of Defense Forces, Akikuyu. Chief of the Navy, Aluo. Chief of the Air Force, Amumeru. And the second topmost person, Eluhia. If you look at that newspaper, he has balanced those tribes. And, and the way this professor of politics, Ruto, is playing, he knows that with Raila going to Addis Ababa, we will start talking of 2033. 
Sincerely. And <laughs> that is what I wanted to say. I've seen Luhias, especially from my home village, Luandeti, those who are associated with, um, with Azimio, saying, ah, wetangula uh, amemalizwa, mudabadi amemalizwa. Wetangula was not finished. Mudabadi was not finished. They were not there in the, even in the first place. Their political journey ends here. Ruto has identified, remember, what was the last job that Nani did? Uh, Natembea. Natembea's last job was, he was the regional coordinator of Rift Valley. He was very close to Ruto. You get my point? So he went and joined DAP. By Natembea becoming vocal, the first casualty is who? Eugene Wamalu. In DAP Kenya, who is Nani Anakoho Asai? Sini Natembea. Now in Luhia land, suppose Natembea becomes another center of power. And listen to what Natembe is saying. Natembe is saying that he has no issue with the old politicians. The Mudabadi of the 60s and Wetangula of the 50s. He is saying that the, 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 the next people to take over from Ruto are those born in the 70s and he's one of them. You get it? So he's saying that uh, the 50s lost it. Those who were born in the 50s, those who were born in the 40s, lost it. Because Moi was born in the 20s, Kibaki was born in the 30s. Then the 40s and 50s lost it. The 60s we are lucky, we had two. We had Uhuru and we have Ruto. So what, what uh, Natembe is saying is that the next president would be in the 70s, those who were born in the 70s. Ion Diompira in Achezo. And he is also complaining that people in Azimio are complaining that he's working with the government. Now that is where the trick is. Where Natembe is working with the government. He's not longer. If you, if you can see the Ntawe movement, it's being followed. Have you seen any politic, these political bigwigs in Azimio? You see, political bigwigs, and that is why I'm saying Ruto is a, is a professor of politics. Natembe, Natembe is coming up, pulling up crowds from Western, pulling, pulling, pulling. And you see, in politics, just as we were taught in intelligence, there is no coincidence. If it is coincident, it was planned. Now, for Mugarabai, Amaragoli. You know, there are some names in Luya. It is very hard to find a Bukusu called Mugarabai. And it is hard to find a Maragoli called Wasike. They are there, but it is very hard. So I'm telling you, I'm telling my viewer, that a politician is like Peter Dao. Peter Dao used to stay near the goalpost. Mpire na tokezea, he had seen. Eh? There was even a joke that uh, one time his goal was refused because he was told, Tunachesa football, not headball. So politicians are like Peter Dao, who stays just there for a chance, just a mini chance, and he scores. So this thing came. You see, Natembea has a chemistry with the Ruto. And that is why he says, what is wrong with an opposition governor co cooperating with the central government? So he has a chemistry with the Ruto. And you can see, when Raila goes to Addis Ababa, 
Azimio and ODM will die. So new forces are coming. And if you can see it, and that is why I call Ruto the professor of politics, is that even before he took over, he started grooming the 70s people. So he knows that in Kikuyu land, he has Didi Nyoro. In Kisi, he has Osoro. But you see Osoro, Enya sore ya tio kirene ya soi re. So he has, so it has so, enya sore ya soi re and it has soiled his chances. But he would have been a very good person uh, to be appointment in that region. You go to Western, he can groom up a person like Natembe and so on and so forth. So, uh, I think you, for those of my age, or I think there is a book called uh, Government Inspector. And uh, I don't know whether it is still in the shelves, but my age mates have read the Government Inspector. When the Government Inspector, the so-called Government Inspector left that town and went away, there was a quarrel between the mayor's wife and the mayor's daughter. He has fallen for me, he has fallen, mother and daughter, irrespective of the mother being married and even being the mother of this. Both were saying, ah, the government inspector fell for me, some such and such a thing. That is the government inspector, uh, Dr. Ruto Kipchirchir. The people in Azimio, especially youth Luhias, are saying that Amemaliza Mudavadi, Amemaliza Wetangula. But they are not knowing that even them, Eugene Amemaliza, well, anybody in the, in the Azimio from Luhia land, it's not hard. So, so Natembe is going to Tembe there. It's a bit complicated, but that is how it is. So what I'm seeing is that uh, uh, a good footballer, just like I said, Peter Dow, is somebody whom he, 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 the ball has just to come to his place and he heads it into. That is what Ruto has done. And in the long run, you'll have to discover that Natembea is a systems person. Thank you.